Hey guys, it's Miss George. So today we're gonna do an art activity that has to do with the ocean. So we've read about Rainbow Fish and Rainbow Fish lives in the ocean with all of his friends. And we've also talked about water pollution and how our trash and the chemicals and pesticides, how that can affect the ocean that the animals live in. So we're going to make an ocean picture. So what you'll need is a white paper or you can use notebook paper or any kind of paper that you have at home and then you're also going to need like a brown or tan paint I had to make mine so it's not exactly brown and then you can have any other colors you would like I have purple red and I also have yellow but you can use any color that you would like and then also you will need a little paper towel or a napkin all right, so what we're going to do is the first thing, we're gonna paint the sand at the bottom of our paper. So that's where you're going to use your brown. And I'm just gonna kinda of make mine like a squiggly line. And I'm gonna paint it all in at the bottom. This will be kind of like the sand at the bottom. Now we're going to make the coral reef. So what you're going to need to do is you're going to take your straw and you're going to dip it into the paint. You're gonna get paint on the end of the straw. Then you're going to put it close to the paper and then you're going to blow through the straw and the paint's going to come out. All right, let's see if I can get a close up so that you can see. So you're just blowing. So I'm gonna get some more paint. And you can move the straw around so wherever you need it to go. And you can put however much of one color you want or as little. This is your picture. That blew a bubble. So you're going to do that all the way across the page. You can use the different colors. So I'm going to pause and then I'll be right back and I'm going to go ahead and finish the picture so you can see what it will look like. All right guys, so I have finished my coral, coral reef, but I did forget to tell you, after you are done with one color, then you will take your paper towel and squeeze it kind of and wipe all the paint out of the straw before you go to your next color. But this is what it could look like. Yours may look different and you can use different colors, but then you're gonna want all of this to dry and then you can add your little fish onto the back. So after this is dry, I would go back and I would color all of the background blue to make the water. And then after you've colored the water, then you can uh, glue your little fish down. All right, I hope you have fun and I cannot wait to see all of your pictures. Bye guys.